he told me one day that the fight or lose that both of them can never agree on one thing in this life i was like boom 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 red flag so when she told me since then i left her like a good man will come for you okay just be a little just little 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 bit patient okay hi there today we're having a video which is few wrong reasons why people get married few wrong reasons why people get married there are good reasons why people get married there are also wrong reasons why people get married so today we're going to talk about the wrong reasons why people get married number one is lost i know it is stated in the bible that if you cannot control instead of you to burn get a partner i'll put it in the comment section in the in the video which is first corinthians 7 verse 9 it says if you cannot if you cannot hold instead of you to burn get married now one of the wrong reasons is lost in the sense that do not mistake lost for whatever it is not right if you think getting married is an escape route this this loss is for people that run from skirt to skirt whatever you see in skirt you run from it marriage will not stop you from being a skirt ambassador if you run from if you if you cannot stay from everything in skirt marriage is not for you marriage will not solve that solution marriage will only solve it when you know that okay you want this desire you've gotten to the age you are mature enough you are this you are that and that part of here such satisfaction is one of the purpose in marriage but if you know you have a skirt issue you're having a bastard of skirt you run after everything is scared if we should get a wood and put skirt if you know you will run after that wood marriage is not the solution you need to undo that problem on its own before getting married okay so the next reason why the next wrong reason why people get married is infatuation you just start thinking that in the morning your husband will give you breakfast in bed lunch in the beach like a lady true life story she said she said that when she get married she will always lie on her husband morning to night and one day like three days in their honeymoon the husband told her that your weight is much let my chest rest she, infatuation I, I told her this is marriage like it's not as if he's running from you is anything but just humanly the weight on his chest is much you full grown human being you want to be on somebody's chest don't you have the fear of god so that's an another wrong reason you just start infatuation just start reasoning things that do not exist in your head that oh when i get married what nollywood bollywood all infatuation drama please do not put someone's child or someone's son into trouble okay please 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 another wrong reason why people get, mar get married is that you just like the idea you just like the idea that's <laughs> it's the same reason why you dislike the idea it's the same reason why when the troubles come you run because it's idea you like you are not even ready to go through the seven seas you are not even ready when the test of time comes when troubles will come the good the bad and the terrible time you are you just want the good thing no no just liking the idea you have to be there are so many intentionalities you need to use in this app there are so many intentionalities you need to do two of you come together and work it out just liking the idea you have to be intentional you have to be serious you have to be deliberate that i am ready okay another wrong reason why people get uh, married is fear of being unmarried maybe in your circle every one of them is married and you're like i'm the only one left in this group eh? i need to get somebody so you will not get a wrong person just because you want to run from the circle my dear may you not rush in and rush out may you not run and come back immediately so mm -hmm. please you have to be deliberate you need to be detailed you need to be serious you need to be serious to say that okay i am ready companionship to fulfill the will of god for procreation there are so many good reasons not because you want to you want to get back at your friends or at somebody else no you so by, by some reason you go and pick the wrong person because you are in a hurry to get back at someone no okay another wrong reason is pressure peer pressure like from your friends from your circle they should not make you pick the wrong person okay nobody should pressure you nobody should pressure you you can get married at any age a broken relationship is better than a broken marriage when you wait a little you get the right person will come for you rather than rushing and settling for someone that is less your standard okay please do not do that this year no 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 fear of being deceived they feel that if um 
if if this person should leave them nobody else will marry them again somebody else will come and deceive them when they are of old age no if you get the right person at your age marry but if you get if that person is not the right person the content of the person's character does not please the will of god does not please your wants and your needs they are not true criteria for a spouse do not accept the person because of peer pressure okay do not accept the person because of the fear of being deceived or the fear of being left alone your friends are getting married so then you pick somebody else can't you see a lot of bad things that's, that are happening because you get married today you rush in and you rush out okay so please that should not be happening in this year okay do not do it another wrong reason why people get, uh, get married is because of money like a poverty enrichment scheme so maybe the girl has a good job the guy has a good job <sighs> money is good in marriage but money is not the only thing that will keep marriage okay so if you see this person and the person does not meet the will of god the person does not look like somebody you can build the future with and the person is rich the person may even be rich and stingy so please go for other core values money is good but money alone cannot keep a home okay and another wrong reason why people get married is uh for international papers to get your stay or your visa in another country i'm not sure any christian will do that no a christian will not do that so i'm not going to talk about that that is a wrong reason why you get married okay marriage is for intentionality both of you should be ready to cross the seven seas both of you should be ready to do life together okay please do not do that no christian should do that another wrong reason why people married is escape route i don't know what you're running from okay i don't know what you are actually running from okay another wrong reason why people get married is self-pity Maybe you just find this person and the person, maybe the person is sick, the person has health issues, has financial issues, or the person just came out from heartbreak, parents are disturbing the child, the person is living with one auntie, uncle, the suffering, the person out of pity, not love, out of pity, you just pity the person. Like maybe you just met a man, he lost his wife, he has a kid, out of pity, not love. Please marry for love, not for pity, okay? Marry for love, not for pity. Not that wrong reason why people marry. Think foolish expectation. How can you expect you yourself, a full grown woman, to lay on a full grown man? Not like for 10, 5 minutes, morning, a uh, night the morning, every day. I go as a lady, do you have the fear of God? You just you just wake up one morning how you and you have one foolish expectation. My friend told me that her husband will make her breakfast in bed every day. I was like, ah, is the man not going to go to work, Auntie? You won't you go to work, Auntie? What if you travel? They are, they are all realistic expectations. Please cut it off. I know there are some key points, there are some romantic moments, but it, can, it cannot be every day. Spontaneous, spontaneous movement uh, spontaneous moment cannot be every day. It cannot be every day in this marriage yeah, because you have real life situation. You have a lot of good things to do, a lot of good things to do, okay? So another wrong reason why people get married physical beauty like it says beauty will fade okay do not get married because of six pack one kind of hair or nose or eye or whatever part of the body because beauty will fade and the beautiful ones are not yet born so whoever you are seeing that oh this person is beautiful six pack backside figure eight hourglass remember the beautiful ones are not yet born another wrong reason why people get married is accidental pregnancy the person is pregnant remember in this channel we don't support um we don't support outside marriage do the do so it's done in marriage so accidentally if you are married if you get pregnant for this person and the person character does not meet the will of god this, this is not a person most of you can come and work with do not get married to the person because of peer pressure or because it is the mother of your child or the father of your child no because you cannot build a home with that person okay okay but if this person is the father or the mother of your child and you can build a home with the person good like my friend got married i actually wanted her to my no my friend was pregnant and she gave birth i actually wanted her to get married to the person i tried to talk to her talk to her then she told me one day that the fight always that both of them can never agree on one thing in this life i was like boom 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 red flag so when she told me since then i left her like 
a good man will come for you okay just be a little just little 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 bit patient okay and put your hope in jesus another wrong reason why people get married is tribe or connection so if this person is from your tribe i know that getting married sometimes you have a list like i want my husband to be this like me before getting married i made a separate a foolish list i don't know a greedy list i actually forgot i said i wanted somebody like yoruba and um edo state like from edo state and yoruba mixed together i don't even know what was wrong with me you know i had forgotten it until i told somebody in my church one of the sunday school teachers and she reminded me that god has actually given you your yoruba and edo state mixed together and i told my friend that this is what this lady told you like have you forgotten what you were saying so i know that we have some natural desires i wonder oh i want my husband to do this i want my husband to but but that yoruba and edo state is not a key factor it's just i i actually said it but it's not it may be what i like but it's not a key factor but that's what attracts it connect it 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 um it 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 connotes how you attract people it connotes how you attract people here yeah, but that's not a key factor so despite the fact that this person is from your the same state with you or the same ethnic group if the person has a red flag flee flee okay okay marry someone based on the person's content of ease or a character that is what will help you to build a successful marriage not tribal connection although tribal connection may help it might be one of your needs or one of your wants but the key factor is content of character okay and the last on my list is parental pressure hmm oh you don't want to hurt your parents your parents want you to marry this person and this person is really not good this person is really not bad this and your parents want you to marry this person so i i do not support when people disobey their parents but in this situation in this situation you need to call your parents and tell them that marriage is a lifelong existence i'm going to be with this person the rest of my life and explain the red flags to this person because your parents might be friends with the person's parents and they don't know the person in person they don't know the person's character you are the one close to the person you will know if this person has smoking habits if this person has a tendency to bully you if this person is greedy if this person is not financial independent you are the one to know so please not because you want to please your parents i do not suppose disobedience okay i do not support the disobedience or maybe you want to please your parents or an elder in church or your elder somebody that has referred this person to you yes but if this person character content of the person's character is not okay wrong you know why you are the one in the marriage okay because now they might be telling you okay this person is good for you say referral is not bad your parents can actually say okay this person is done in the bible this person will go and look for wife for this person like the one that says uh, let down that picture to give these people the sheep water blah 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 it is done but if the character is not good you have to flee yes in no time do you know your parents will be happy with you yeah that thing happened to me like someone referred someone to me and we're close for some time and it didn't work out i did not say because it is this person i'll have to go into something that will be judgmental to my future choosing the wrong father for my children no i let them i call them out like you people you are good this person is good however Things did not work out with us because of this, this, this and there's so reason with me okay so i know that some parents can be pushy this and this so god will help you and and another thing is that the last one is that the list is not going to end please if you know any wrong reason why anyone have gotten married you can leave it in the comment section below thank you for watching the video please subscribe thank you